Today we are going to look at the different types of energy transfers, conduction, convection, and radiation. We will first start with conduction. Let's take a look at a picture that represents conduction. What do you think conduction means just by looking at this picture? Conduction is a transfer of heat or thermal energy by touching. It occurs in solids. It is a transfer of heat from the warmer part of an object to the cooler part of the same object. For example, if you have a pot that is on the stove, it's going to get hot on the surface that's touching the burner and that will continue to move to the cooler part of the, part of the pot that is up at the top. It can also be transferred from a hotter object to a cooler object. Refer back to the picture. On the picture, the metal spoon was leaning up against the metal pot. That metal spoon will become hot because that heat will be transferred from the hot pot to the cold spoon. The next type of energy transfer we're going to look at is convection. Take a look at this picture. What do you think convection means? All right, convection, unlike conduction, occurs in liquids and gases. It is the transfer of heat through the movement of particles. Warm particles rise, cool particles fill in the space below. So this is a circular motion. Think about a house. Have you ever noticed that maybe upstairs or in an attic it gets warmer? That's because the warm air rises and it's usually colder downstairs. All right, the third energy transfer we're going to discuss is radiation. Take a look at the picture and decide what you think radiation means. It is a transfer of energy as waves and it travels through matter or empty space. So radiation, what we usually think about is the sun. The earth is warm because the rays from the sun are traveling through matter and casting the heat to the earth. So let's take a look at one more picture. This picture demonstrates all three forms of energy transfer. Right now I want you to take a moment to look at this picture and explain how conduction, convection, and radiation are demonstrated in the visualization.